non-duality has the answer to the spiritual search because it has this simple message that basically says anything we think is wrong. Whatever you want to define enlightenment or awakening or even what it means to be a human being, anything you think about it is wrong because the thinking about it, you're thinking about thinking with your mind that can only think. Non-duality says that's nuts. That's nuts to do that, to think that you can think your way out of thinking. It just simply can't happen. So the advantage of it is the fact that you can just go, okay, that's not working. That can't work. Just by definition, that cannot work. So what do we do? Is there something else? Is there something beyond the definitions and the words that are in our mind trying to describe life? And non-duality also has the answer to this. It's like, yes, unity. Everything is united together. So here's a little secret. Think about this. Non-duality says, forget about your mind. It's useless. Kind of doesn't work really well. All your thoughts and all your definitions. But you're still alive, right? You're still there. You've been there all along since the day you were born. So what is that simple, simple thing that's been there all along? Looking out of your eyes, living your life. Who is living your life? It's not your definitions or your mind that's living your life. You can find this thing. Until then, just accept that simple, simple idea that all the definitions about it are wrong. All the thoughts about it are just wrong. And this will put you kind of into, it puts you into a dynamic state of curiosity. Like, so what? What then? Yeah, I mean, obviously my words can't describe it, right? What? Who is curious about it? 